What were they thinking? What do you mean? Oh, to paint a painting full of mushrooms. What do you think of their inspiration? Well, the obvious comes to mind. They probably just really love gardening. Gardening. Ah, must be that. Couldn't be anything else. Nathan, by the way. I'm married. Married? Hmm. I call bullshit. Excuse me? Oh, I can't do that? No, it's just what makes you think I'm not? Oh, well, I mean, being here, alone in front of a painting at an art gallery. I assume that your husband would have dragged you here. Uh, and also, in the ring. Kick it off. Well, if you took it off, then it'd be more of a lighter color around your ring finger. And more obviously, a woman as big as you is not usually alone with this type of thing. So, again, I call bullshit. So if you're not a big fan of art, then why are you here? I'm not a fan, but my friend is. Is your friend blinked in the last minute? I don't think so. No. What's your name? Samantha. Well, Sam. I think she's Samantha. Yo, Nate, this is Dave. This party is off the hook. You gotta come out, man. Marked for deletion. Hey, Nathan, this is James. Let's go get drinks tonight. Call Marked for deletion. Nathan, we got beers with you. Marked for deletion. Nathan Joseph Mayberry, this is your mother. You know, some children actually call their mothers back, like your brother, David. Mark, mark, marked for deletion. Hey, Nathan. It's Mike. Haven't heard from you in a while. Just thought I'd give you a call. <sighs> Listen, if you need someone to help you get back to life, you know I'm here for you. Six months? That's... that's a long time. You gotta try to... Where are you? Ugh, four days just to get away. Why didn't we think about doing this sooner? Mm, I don't feel like we've had much time to think about doing anything, let alone a trip. That's really worth it, though. Yeah, no, it is. Hey, babe. Hmm? Do you remember Janet? Janet. Janet, uh... Oh, yeah! Uh, no, no idea. <laughs> All right, smartass. <laughs> do, you, do you remember the gallery where we met? Um, yeah, the art gallery where um, your friend who was obsessed, I mean, in love with all the art and, uh also stared at walls. Yeah, that Janet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
She's married. Oh, so she found someone else to stare at walls with. <laughs> no, honestly, I don't think anyone could beat her at that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'd be amazed. Would you ever want that for us? So, uh, when are you proposing? What? <laughs> oh, I'm not doing a single thing. Shut up. Don't tell me you haven't thought about this. Mm. Ooh, ooh. Uh, damn it. What is it? Um, I think we got a flat tire. Yeah, babe, I think we got a flat. Will it take long to fix? It shouldn't take too long, but I don't think we'll be able to make it to the ridge before nightfall. Hey, don't worry about it. We've got four days. We'll have plenty of time to watch the sunset when we're at our spot. Let's just uh, take care of this and get going. Hmm. Okay. Hey, you think any of these drivers will pull over if I show a little leg? Oh my gosh, I'm the only one that would pull over for that. <laughs> get out there. Let's fix the tire. Yeah. I mean, I would too, but... Sam!
Nathan. Mike? Well, how'd you get in here? You gave it to me in case of an emergency. Is this an emergency? I think trying to get your best friend back into the world after six months is an emergency. Good luck. You guys were great together. Yeah. Yeah, we were. But then she disappeared. And I don't know, I don't know why. I, I feel like, you know, maybe it was something I did. Maybe she had these feelings towards me that she just couldn't handle and she couldn't tell me about, so she left. No, I don't think it was that. Yeah. Neither did I until that morning. And, uh, I never told her this, but like, it was by everything. She was. Yeah, but she knew that. That's why she didn't walk out on you. She disappeared. You can't let that one moment stop you from going out and living your life. She wouldn't have wanted that. Still could have done more though. Like what? You were fixing your car. You didn't know. Yeah. Well, why do you care? Because I want you to be happy. Yeah. Does it mean, does it really look like I'm ready to move on right now? I'm not saying move on. I'm saying you need to get the hell out of your apartment and get back into the world. Yeah. You have friends and family, people that care about you, people that want to help you. And if she is found, your brother is going to be the first to let you know if she's found. So go out there and live your life instead of wasting away in the memory of her. Let it go, man. Yeah, you're right, actually, yeah. Damn right I am. Let's go grab a drink. Yeah. By the way, I love your mom, but can you tell her to stop calling me? just got off work. And you are probably driving. I'm really excited to see what you have planned for us tonight. It's all I've been thinking about all day. See you soon. I love you. Stop. Have a seat. So what'd you find out? Six months. And that's what you have to say? What did I find out? I'm sorry. Why? For not being there. But what I've been through. Don't give me that. I was there for you. Mom was there for you. We both reached out multiple times, but you ignored us. Mom has called me every day for six months because you won't answer your phone. Did you just call me up here just to tell me off? Hmm? No, you found something. You wanna just call me up here for- Can I just see how you're doing? Is she alive? No. What happened? 
We found her body a few days ago in a cabin. The body showed no signs of a struggle, and there was no signs of foul play. We're just waiting on the talks report now to find out what happened. Man, if it was, if we just didn't have that stupid flat, you know, she'd still be alive. <laughs> it was, I shouldn't have left the- This is your fault. You did nothing wrong. What you need to do now is just try and put this in your past and get over it. I don't know. I need answers. What are you gonna do? There's nothing you can do. I could go back to where she disappeared. And do what? My team come over for a week. There's nothing there. You need to call mom. You need to be with friends and family now. I'll find out what happened, I promise. Come on. Hey, um, thanks. How's she doing? I was hoping that wasn't the case. Yeah, yeah, everything fits. No signs of a struggle. Complete memory loss. Yeah, it's the MO of the Green River Killer. 